Welcome back to the short installment of my micro hydro project. Uh, today we've had a lot of rain and I'm going to grab my shovel. It's under the deck here. We still haven't <clears throat> sold our property, but we're expecting two offers today. Uh, a big reason for me doing this video, first because you guys like content, uh, second is because the guy uh, Seth Johnson over at Land to House has a similar flume and just did a similar video on you know unclogging all the leaves and all that stuff after a few storms. Now we've had a few storms too. But we haven't had, I mean, haven't had the water wheel running. And you can kind of see it there gathering a little bit of water and dumping it, and gathering a little bit of water and dumping it. And it, the water here is really deep. That's a lot of water. I do need to clear out all of the vegetation. That would lower the water level quite a bit here. So in here you can see, you know, it's got some leaves in it, lots of leaves really. Sorry about the video quality, it's kind of dark. Um, so here's my gate here and I can just tap it shut like that and we're chasing the water What do you think, Quill? Huh? Yeah. That's uh, really fun and interesting. I'm happy to share it with you. You can see how much water that's churning. I don't know how much energy that would be powering or providing if I were to hook up a generator. Obviously more if it didn't have the drag on the bottom, but that's still quite a lot. I guarantee there's a lot of force there. <laughs> 